I don't think people still fully understand the power that food has. About one in five deaths is actually diet related. And so this environment that we're living in right now is toxic and the food that we're eating contributes to that. But the center is very different. The center has done things differently for a very long time. We understood a long time ago that food has to be central for care and has to be central for treatment. The center's farm began with a small organic vegetable plot in 1983. Today, a team of 13 farmers harvest food from 300 acres of certified organic and biodynamic farmland. 30 chefs and three dietitians plan and serve up to 1,800 meals a day to the center community. People come here and they see a beautiful farm. If you look a little deeper, you see more than that. You see medicine and solutions. You find health here. And it's all interconnected. So if we're eating better and we have the nutrients our body needs, we're sleeping better, which in turn decreases our stress and anxiety. It resolves our GI issues. It really gets us back to human potential and really maximizing the quality of life and the quality of care that we can provide. The future of nutrition is to have individualized protocols, precision medicine for people dealing with disease. It's looking at someone's makeup, it's understanding who they are, and designing diet protocols that can address their specific needs. The Center for Discovery is poised to be at the forefront of that research. The Center has built an interdisciplinary research institute from its groundbreaking research program to further understand and better treat complex conditions. Collaboration is key to the Center's success, from its research partnerships with scientists from major universities to its Department of Nourishment Arts. Chefs, farmers, nutritionists, and physicians work together from seed to belly to ensure the health of the individuals served at the Center for Discovery. Here at the center, we have a very robust data set, and now we have very sophisticated um, data analytic tools that we can begin to data mine lifestyle, you know, the effects of food, these, the effects of stress and diet on the individual, how they're sleeping at night, and really understand the impact that all of those lifestyle conditions have on somebody who has a complex disorder. We have a local college here, we have connections with universities, Cornell, other places that are doing this type of work, but we have the ability um, with our research team to begin to conduct some of those studies, and I think that that's really important. Food is a universal language. We eat it every day, multiple times a day, hopefully for years on end. The center is in a unique position to study why that food is so important to not only the individuals that we serve here, but to all of us. What happens here matters everywhere.